Chase Briscoe doing an outstanding job here. Let's see if he can lead that second pack as we come to two to go back up to the front pack. I want to remind everyone there's a number of cars in this lead draft that made their pit stop at lap 25. Will Kimmel pitted at lap 20, ran out of fuel. There are others up front that could have some question marks behind their name when it comes to fuel mileage late in this race. Yeah, Dylan Lupton right there, probably out of gas as well. The ARC officials are telling him to turn in. Doesn't look like he's gonna have enough speed to get back around. Mm, could we get a caution? See if he turns in here, he's gonna turn, get off the racetrack here. You see that lap by Will Kimmel. But that allowed Chase Briscoe, the 77 car, to catch up to Kyle Weatherman now. Starting to get interesting. White flag in the air as they come through the trioval. John West Townley, two and a half miles away from his second win at Daytona. See Frank Kimmel jump on the line back there running around seventh or eighth. He's got a little bit of help on the outside. Is he gonna have enough time? Good start to what could be his final season in the ARCA Racing Series. Drafting help from Cole Custer is there. And he's getting a big push. Kevin Thomas Jr. also in that mix with Frank Kimmel. Not sure they have enough time to get to John Westtown. The leaders in turn four for the final time. Big shove in the outside lane for Frank Kimmel. Coming all the way right now up to the fourth spot. Where did the momentum score. come from? The 10 time Ghost champion trying to make it happen in the outside lane, but he's not going to get there. John West Townley, the winner at the Long Island of Racing. Oh, oh. Kevin Reed goes back to victory lane. 